What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of the We'll Push Show. Yo. Welcome. Uh, <laughs> it's been a seen, minute. Yeah, haven't been seeing each other. Yeah, it's been a minute. Nice to see you, sir. Nice to see you, sir. Peace. Peace. <laughs> uh, so, uh, a lot of information's gone out since the last time we made a video. Trump has been elected president. Yeah, I mean, that's video. the biggest thing. Like, uh, um, we're just gonna have to help create a whole new channel about that shit. But, uh, we'll make that later. Yeah, we'll, we'll, <laughs> we'll worry about that later. <laughs> Uh, I mean, today I guess we're just going to do something kind of, kind of basic, right? Just do the news blitz about all kinds of crap that came out. Uh, give you guys a, a lot of update. Crap. Yeah, a Since lot of crap. Uh, Which well, was yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yesterday. Yesterday was our last video. Um, we had a big spike in subscribers as well. Big oh, things coming soon. We went right. from 12 to 20, so <laughs> to show you guys our appreciation, uh, we might do like an AGB gift card giveaway. <laughs> Uh, High dollar. <laughs> assuming that most of our subscribers are in Houston. Or in Texas. Or in Texas. Oh, they got HEBs in Texas? Or are just a Houston? Can we win our own giveaway? I guess, given that we are... <laughs> the, <laughs> given that we are three of those 20. Um, but I, I, who gives a fuck, right? 20's 20. 20's but uh, let's go ahead and just kick it off with the first <clears throat> topic. So, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 2. The trailer? Trailer the dropped. Trailer. Uh, I mean, there's like, what, two trailers already? Two, yeah, two yeah, trailers. Yeah. One was a teaser, the other one is a trailer. I mean, they're both technically teasers. Mm. I don't know. Oh, but Baby Groot, man. <laughs> Groot's yeah. creepy. Baby Groot, bro? He looks creepy, man. Like, he... he but just, I, I, I thought, thought it was really funny towards the end. Yeah, the, the trailer movies can be funny. Yeah, he, right? he stole the show. I think he stole the show. But he in terms of the trailer. If that little thing came at me, dude, I'd be scared. Yeah, another thing is, uh, what's his name, uh, Drax seems like a jackass. He kind of seems like a jackass. He's, like he's, kinda, he's more he was, confident with the crew now. He's a yeah. little bit more dickish. He was, he was a jackass either way, Tom. I, really, I feel like he was more serious in the first one. Now he just seems like he's the... He's more like confident. A clown he's man? trying to be a clown. Yeah, man, okay, you know? okay. I see what you're saying. Like that last confident. part. He's more yeah. confident. With yeah. Um, uh, I guess it, the action looks awesome. I mean, the music... I, for me, I'm more excited about the music. The music in the first one was fucking badass. Yeah. So uh, it looks like they're. It's I'm more be... interested to see how they're gonna do his dad. Well, there was Star nothing Lord. in the trailer. Star Lord, no. Star Lord's dad, because he's a planet. Yeah, so. So I wanna know what. They haven't really shown anything in the trailer. Who's the actor of... that's playing his dad? Uh, Kurt Russell. He's pretty. Eagle the planet. Pretty legit. So we'll, see, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> yeah. We'll know how he was. Uh... They had to sell. They had to buy that from Fox, right? Because. The, the Fox owned the yeah. Fox owned the rights to Eagle. Oh really? Yeah. I don't know. So, oh, see, I, see, I didn't they, know that. You know. So they ended, up changing, they, ended, they ended up changing some stuff on Deadpool. So they came into agreement. Oh, okay. So that's the only reason why he's coming out on the, on the Guardians of the Galaxy. If not, then there would have been a whole, to, to, whole totally different story about that. I just want to know how the planet got down with the mom. Oh, well, we'll find out. I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty sure they're going to address that shit. So. Extended edition? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to the, we're gonna have to wait until the till the director's cut. <laughs> nah, hell, not. Marvel ain't no DC. Chill out. But, uh... They ain't there yet. <laughs> they ain't there yet. <laughs> but if you yeah. haven't seen the trailer, go watch it. Yeah, go check out the trailer, guys. It's actually pretty awesome. It's funny. Uh, yeah, it's pretty funny. Baby movie, when's the movie come out? The uh, movie comes out, I think it's in May 2017 or some shit like that. Sometime around. Yeah, but I, I guarantee you another trailer will drop before that. So, I mean, uh, we'll be sure to let you guys uh, know about that as soon as it happens. Uh, yeah. Next topic, Logan. There's a lot of lonely pictures of him in the uh, desert. I, I think the movie looks badass. Uh, especially because it's going to be the last one. My, my tier, 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 tier. So it's the last trailer that we got. There hasn't been really nothing else. No, just yeah, in terms of, yeah. Just behind the yeah, scenes pictures. Just behind the scenes like pictures. That. A lot of like, no, well, not even interviews. Like there hasn't been any interviews about the movie. Very, yeah, because it's very gritty. Yeah, yeah, they did do an early screening. They showed 40 minutes of the movie to like some critics and it got really damn good reviews. I mean, they said it's not like an X-Men movie. They said it's got like a, type of like a Western feel to it. I, I, it's a standalone Wolverine movie, yeah. so it's gonna be good. Yeah, I think it'll be, be good. Damn good. It's gonna yeah. be good. It's gonna be the if best. If you haven't watched the trailer, shame on you. I mean, what the fuck are you doing with your life? It's gonna be the number one X Men movie. Oh yeah, that, like, that without that, a yeah. doubt, without a doubt, it's gonna be the number one. Movie. I think it'll be good, man. Uh, it's gonna be big. What else? Uh, just the picture that he released, right? That's yeah. It. I mean, just the picture and yeah. the. Cast as far as casting announcements, uh, like they haven't really gone into too much in the detail. I mean, there hasn't been really much yeah. anything released besides the pictures and the 
And a trailer. I you mean, think we'll be getting a trailer soon? Uh, I, I feel right? like there's gonna be a trailer on the Super Bowl. So Super Bowl is a bit, if you guys don't know, like it's a really big, like platform for like uh, movie companies to release trailers and stuff. So I see Logan trailer drop on that time. Trailers? Yeah. So if a trailer drops, I mean, we'll let you guys know in terms of like what's out now. There's not really that much. Just check out the trailer. Check out the pictures. Uh, next topic we got, guys, is uh, Power Rangers. Now a lot of shit has come out for Power Rangers. Since the last time, since yesterday, since we made our video yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> what do you what do you think is the most the one thing that stands out for you the most? Uh, the, the everything the fucking the Megazords, bro. The like, Megazords? I, I oh, thought dude, that they was, fucking look badass. They man. look sick, they man. Look I was I was really happy. Like I, if you guys haven't seen the image of the actual uh, Megazord, like combined the, the actual. What do you call it? I guess you can just call it it's the, the full robot. Basically. The full robot the Zord, full the combination. Like, it not, looks not, not only the the. The, the well, dinosaur version, but like yeah, the whole thing. Well, especially when they combine their damn robots together, it looks more human than you would expect because I'm so used to like fucking, you know, the cartoon where like the blocks yeah. and stuff like that. So, like, I'm assuming like if these robots are getting together, it's not gonna be like a perfect human shape. It's gonna Hope be they don't like, show the same moves. Like, yeah. TV shows like the same thing over and over so again. So, like, um, the actual full combination didn't look too promising to me based off of the toy image, but. Uh, um, but there's been releases about the the, well, the new toys have been released already, and but they haven't released how so it's gonna look in the movie, right? No, well, that no, we haven't got an image, but we, we did get a poster. Like, there's a poster, guys. Uh, we'll have a little image there for you guys to see with the actual Megazords. Uh, you only see Yellow Rangers. Uh, you see all of them, but most of them are like yeah, some of them the are fog. in the fog. Yeah, some of them in the fog. You do see the T Rex, which yeah. looks fucking sick. And I'm glad they didn't put the fucking the fucking gun on his back. Yeah, like, it looks. Have, you think that's gonna come out later on? Uh, well, yeah, you know. I'm pretty well, sure, uh, you know, Alpha's gonna start developing tech and stuff for that. Okay, what about Alpha? All right, let's. That's another point. Alpha. I, I think if it's. I didn't like I, how. Alpha I think looks. if it's the voice actor, because he's funny. Alpha looks kind of chill in this picture. Could be a hater, right? Yeah, I mean, we'll have but, another image here as well. Put image there, but uh. I don't know. A lot of people don't like it. Um, a, lot of, a lot of people like it, but I, all I have to say is that this is a fucking reboot, and for reboots, we're gonna have a lot of things that are different. Alpha does look kind of weird. <laughs> he looks weird. I mean, he's got but, a fucking beer belly, guys. Like, but like, I, but I feel, I feel like Alpha's gonna be a main character that's gonna like probably blow everybody away just because Bill Hader plays him. Yeah, so, like just I, like BBA. I don't mind the know? belly. I, I mind this. The yeah, eyes, no, that's, dude, that's the eye, thing. Like, the uh, so in the show, yeah, like Alpha. A, if you haven't seen the show, LED I mean, strip. On yeah, I, I guess yeah. YouTube the shit. Uh, Alpha's like a robot and this one he looks like an alien he's an alien well yeah. pretty much this is based around it I just don't like the eyes I can deal with the belly a belly yeah. is cute you know like you throw it on fucking <laughs> Alpha right also, he looks like he's with gonna be like eyes. three feet fucking tall you know but yeah no he looks he looks like he's gonna be way shorter than the original yeah, version yeah I mean but... if anything Bill Hader is gonna be a badass voice actor so I mean that's that's my, probably what's gonna my, save my it. only thing is now that we've seen Alpha we have a glimpse of uh Koga Goldar. Also, Goldar, yeah, we got a glimpse of Goldar, which just looks like a damn CGI fest. But, but my thing is, this makes me wonder how Zordon is going to look. Oh, yeah, we haven't got any... Oh, we have not seen right? Zordon whatsoever. I don't know, man. I'm kind of... I'm, I like... I'm I like the aspect of Goldar. I like how his build was made. I just don't like the fact that he doesn't have a face. Yeah, he's just... He's all that's gold. The only, that's the only thing that I don't like. And yes, it's Goldar, right? Yeah. It's supposed to be all gold. But... I, I think what what brought me down about that image was just the fact that Goldar in the in the TV show he had that blue iconic face. Yeah, and, you know, the, he the looked good, like a he looked like a random dog somewhere stuck in a. The good thing about it is that you can tell that the toy is bad quality. I guess yeah, so gonna, like well, I said, it's yeah. not gonna be it's the for most. Kids, though, yeah, you know, that's what I mean. Because they have the, they have like the good toys and then they have the cheap toys. Yeah, yeah. so we'll and, see. I mean, so we still have to see how like. Honestly, uh, I feel like in the next trailer, which I think they they are aiming for a trailer on the Super Bowl. Keep an eye out. I heard uh, there's gonna be trailers sometime. Yeah, so we, we should. I I feel like in that trailer we should be getting the Zords, and we should be getting Goldar. I feel like we will get an image of Goldar and Zordon as well. I see I picture Zordon popping up maybe towards the end. Just quick images. Other than that, I mean, based off of the damn toys we've seen, it looks pretty shit. themselves came out too. Yeah. But they've been, they've been teasing us pretty bad about it, so. Yeah, you know, so uh, hopefully in the like trailer, that. they kind of they kind of finish the job, you know? I just want to just come. Already. But not too much. <laughs> not too much. Not bad members of Superman too much. Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, who knows? So we'll see, because it depends on, like, you know, if, if they have faith in their movie, then they'll just do another teaser trailer. If they don't have faith, then they're pretty much just going to show the whole fucking movie in the trailer. Well, a lot of people are pretty psyched about it. 
So you know, and I'm one of those people. So I just, yeah. I just can't wait. Well, I already announced the sequel. Too. Yeah. So I already worked. They on wanted to work yeah, on eight movies. Wanted. Yeah. Oh, I heard, I heard of a, of a little rumor going around mm-hmm. that the, I don't know. Guess I know you know, but the seal crystal is gonna appear on the movie. Okay, I didn't yeah. know that, bro. And the Zeo Crystal, if you guys don't know, is the next... It, well, it's not the next season, because the there's three seasons. But it's like the fourth season of Power Rangers, where, you know, Tommy and anybody who was for Mighty Morphin went over and they... They transitioned. They transitioned to the Zeo Rangers. Yeah, So, they're supposed to be... They're going to show the Zeo Crystal. And the Zeo Crystal was very powerful in the TV show. And hopefully, you know, transitions to the seven movies that they, they want to make out. They need to have the suits so. in the back. Yeah, I can see well, you. Oh, yeah, that's my bad. Yeah, they did that. I'm dead. We'll, we'll see. So, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. But right. I heard about that little small rumor. That'd be bad. All right. All right. All right. Next, next topic is uh, Transformers. So we got a teaser trailer. The Last Nights. Which I honestly didn't fucking know there was going to be another Transformers movie. I, I just knew saw it. Was coming I, out. I think it looks badass. I knew there was I, another one coming out. Uh, to be it's honest, just, it looks exactly the same as the rest of the fucking movies. It's All the movies are the same. Yeah, if you guys don't know, Michael Bay, like, has a fucking like he just has a style and like you you know it's a Michael Bay movie just by like explosion scenes. But it, but it looks badass. That, 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 that it looks like Optimus Prime is gonna be a bad guy. Yeah, it looks like he's you under some kind of like mind control because his I mean, eyes. It, if you watch trailer, they're like different like, color. I heard he dies. But that's the thing. He comes back. Well, I mean that no. It, I feel like he is gonna die in this movie because they did it. Um, they did announce that. I don't know if you guys are Transformers fans. If you haven't watched the cartoon Generation One. Uh, they announced that Hot Rod's gonna be in the movie. So when Hot Rod, yeah, yeah, when Hot Rod becomes introduced into the cartoon, Optimus dies and Hot Rod becomes a new. In the trailer, he's already dead. No, he's not dead. He's He's just just floating. He's just floating in space. I think he he just comes back. He just like like, froze over. Optimus Prime. I don't know, but he stabs. uh, What's he called? Well, it looks like he stabs Bumblebee. We'll see. I mean, Uh, uh, it looks like he just comes back reprogrammed. Fast and the Furious or what? Looks yeah. (laughs) The leader turns back. Yeah. Oh, we'll get to that. But uh. Yeah, I might as well, you know, we'll use that as a transition. Uh, so, Transformers, check out the trailer. Uh, not much was released, but... Uh, now check about the, uh, past, the fa- Fate of the fate Furious. Of the fate, fate of the Furious. Fast and the Furious 8. Uh, if you haven't seen that, you should go check it out. I really think that that was a good trailer to turn around what anybody was expecting. I think that everybody I was, was not expecting ex- that, Yeah, though. I think everybody was just expecting cars, racing, a heist. But whenever Vin Di- whatever happened in that trailer with Vin Diesel turning on his own team was crazy. Nobody. There was. No, I did not know. I didn't. There was no clues, no hints. No yeah. Nothing. I had not. It's a. It's a good trailer. I, I think. It's a good. It's a good step for the series to take, especially after like what happened to Paul Walker. R.I.P. I know. Old Paul. That's moment of silence. But uh, it's a. It's a good way to like keep you interested in the yeah. series. Like, I, yeah. did not, I didn't see that shit it coming. Turned it around. I like. I mean, the first movie was nothing about racing and. Yeah, I mean, this doesn't even look shit. like it's just. Honestly, it looks like they're just back to being criminals again. Even like the rocks helping them do shit. Yeah. Now. I was so thinking, I guess he's a bad guy now too. Like, I, was I don't know what the hell. That, uh, that so she she has something on Vin Diesel, right? And oh, that's, why, yeah. and that's why Vin Diesel is helping them. But my thing is that I think that she's using Vin Diesel for them to get out hops and then get. Chasing I don't know. Well, I feel like she's just mind controlling the nigga. She's hot. I think because, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, like I said, like he said, if you haven't watched trailer, watch it. Yeah. But in the beginning of the trailer, she looks uh, Charlize Theron's character, I guess, she is like in, in charge of, uh, <laughs> is in charge of like <laughs> technological <laughs> terrorism or some shit. Wow, man, I don't know. She's that's... shit in that movie. Basically, she does like high tech terrorism. So I'm assuming like he, she must have put like a chip or some shit she's in like his head. Oh, could be too. She's like that. But he does look like he's been. Uh, mind control then yeah cause he, it, he, he, he looks like he wants to resist it whatever's does, yeah. happening he's but not, it, no it doesn't look like he can't resist it doesn't look like he can resist like he's just well, he's doing it like he's not thinking you know well, it, it look, well to me it looked like yeah like, you know type soldier. shit that type shit but you know, know the Winter Soldier he also hesitated to do some things yeah and either way towards the end either, at the end the outcome was he did it yeah I think what Dom is going through is the same thing he kind of looks and he oh, yeah. contemplates what's happening, but at the end, he's just like, oh, I guess. Yeah, I, 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 do doubt, I doubt it that it's like something like she has some kind of beef on him. Like, yeah. Because I feel like he would have just like, hey, look, she has some shit on me. Help me out. This one just looks like he's just doing what she says. So it might be some kind of mind control type shit. Maybe, well, maybe, maybe the only one who knows is this thing. Maybe she offered to bring Paul Walker back. Oh, shit. <laughs> you know? Never know. What's next? But, uh, yeah, so yeah, guys, check out the, the Fast 8 trailer or whatever. Fate of the Furious. The Fate of the Furious. Furious. Uh, so next on the list, let's see what we got, uh, we got, uh, Justice League. Justice League. That's all you have to say. 
I mean, just, just video cutting. Cutting. I mean, there's been a lot of uh, they just released, images and stuff. Uh, yeah, like images, the Flash. Uh, with the tr- with uh not with the Trinity but with Batman and uh, Wonder, Wonder Woman, Woman yeah. right next to each other, looking at Flash. the distance, um, observing something. Maybe Superman. We'll I don't see. know who it yeah, is. They, re- they 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 released who they were staring at. Oh, they did. Who it was, was it? The, some demon, some kind of demon. Oh, that I is think probably. Working for a, this, oh, well, this, at is the a this is a spoiler. This is a spoiler of that's after they talked to Jim Gordon on the on the Gotham thing. On, okay. That's when they meet with Jim Gordon, and oh, the only shit. thing that I've heard is that. That thing about Barry Allen, he's kind of annoying to everybody. Oh, but yeah. But he has beef. But he has no beef with anybody. He's Wonder just that Woman one is... annoying kid that you just... Oh, yeah. I picture that that's going to... Wonder that's... Woman is uh, very compassionate be... but about he has things. A, but he has a right to, you know. He's fast. Yeah. Nobody's going to catch him. He's just him. intrigued with yeah. everybody. You know, it's like, hey, what's that? You know, I could see... If I was next to Batman, I'd be like, hey, what's, what does that do? You know, what does that do? Yeah. And that's probably, yeah. Kind of annoying. But hopefully he's not that annoying. Well, you know, we'll see. I mean, yeah. I just like, like I said, it's like he, I feel like he's gonna be sort of like the, you know, how DC's trying to make the movies more light. I think they're gonna use Flash as that as that as target. that beacon. Yeah. It's like okay, like, like something it. dangerous. Let's say something like bad like an explosion, then Flash is gonna come in and say some kind of like funny one liner or something to kind of lighten up the mood. But yeah. in terms of Justice League itself, I mean, there there hasn't been much release. Just a lot of images, a lot of featurettes, like, like just that, uh, behind the, the scenes. Hammer? Just the Arnie Hammer teases. Army Hammer teases in terms of like he oh him being Green Lantern Green Lantern yeah, Green which Lantern. we don't know like he he's a he's a fucking troll well, on Twitter if you don't know who Army Hammer is but um if Green Lantern shows up in that movie yeah so hopefully we do get a peek of Green Lantern um, on Justice League yeah so yeah. He, he from based off of what DC said he's he's not gonna be in the actual universe until Justice League two but maybe we'll get some like teases as to like you know the Green Lantern Corps or times you know sometimes anything on like anything. Yeah, but other than that, I mean, uh, you you guys said there's a trailer coming out soon, right? Yeah, yes. there's been a lot of speculation on going on a trailer, trailer coming trailer out this month. month but so nothing guaranteed. Hopefully, another trailer drops so we can get more well, Christmas, idea. That'd be great. Oh, that would be awesome. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah that would be. Oh, <laughs> that would be better. We we haven't really talked about what are we what are we talking about next? Uh, Assassin's Creed. Okay. Talk about what do you want to talk about next? Homecoming trailer. Yeah, well, that's gonna be last. We'll say that for Spider-Man. Okay. Yeah, I, I, was, say, I didn't know that was on the list. We gotta say yeah, Spider-Man for like, last, bro. Like, so, uh, yeah, you can just edit this shit out. I mean, you're gonna have to do a lot of editing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. So I guess that's it for Justice League. I mean, uh, next we got is uh, Assassin's Creed. So I saw the movie yesterday. I haven't seen it. So I haven't seen it either. But the trailers looked awesome. I'm, I'm gonna see it. But you can talk about it a little bit. You can, free. you can oh, I mean, I'm not going to do any spoilers. Spoiler. Uh, just fair warning, if you guys aren't really, like, a fan of the series, if you've never played any of the games, and I mean, like, any, uh, preferably, like, the first three, you're not going to understand what the fuck's going on. Like, uh, they did really good with the movie. It's just in terms of explaining, like, what's happening and how everything's working. Like, I just think it's going to so hurt them a bit. more for the gamers? It's more for, like, people that play the games and know, actually, with, like, the series and, like, the characters. I think they're finding a way to take those gamers out of their house. Yeah, so, I mean, <laughs> it's, it's a good movie. It's just, it's not in every, op- like, it's not for all audiences. So, uh, I mean, I'll just say that. Go check it out. I do recommend you watch it. If you are a fan, if you're not, give it a chance. Well, I mean, the action, the action sequence. The action yeah, the action sequences are awesome. awesome. Michael Fassbender did a fucking awesome job. So, just, I mean, yeah, say, go check it out. So, uh, now for the big thing, uh... One that like kind of touches. It's not the big thing. <laughs> it is the big thing. Hey, guys, he's not even a full grown man. <laughs> it, it touches my heart. And I'm really close. Uh, Spider Man Homecoming. Uh, the the trailers. Trailer. I mean, we got two trailers. We got an international trailer and an actual trailer. Um, it was released on a. Uh, well, the international trailer added more footage for like the Vulture and shit. Yeah. But um, if you haven't seen the trailer, check it out. Uh, it's it looks fucking awesome. It's fucking awesome. It looks awesome. It looks uh, fucking awesome. It's. It's way different than the other Spider-Man movies. I can tell you guys that. Uh, well, I mean, to me, it kind of looks the same. I mean, I feel like, like it actually has like a high school vibe. Like, let's say, let's oh, go back. Yeah, 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 let's go to Sam Raimi. Like, from, with, with from a, the c- cinematic. Yeah. Cin- cinematic wise, yes, but a lot of the scenes in the trailer were like the mo- scenes. Yeah, the there's movies. a lot of recreated. So, uh, what I feel is like what Marvel's doing is they're trying to pay their respects to to the previous movies, but at the same time, like it, it feels more. Like, it makes more sense to be a high school movie in terms of, like, if you ever watched the Tobey Maguire series, Why? like, Tobey Maguire looks like a fucking 30-year-old like, man in high school. I feel like this is going to be very different. I feel, well, the then again, movies. then again, Tobey Maguire started, the movie started when he was a senior. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so this, 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 he's a sophomore in high sophomore, school. So, but I feel like there was a lot of more uh, vibrance from the first, well, the Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man. Yeah, it's, you know. 
Yeah, there was a lot of callbacks to the original yeah. uh, trilogy. Like um, the, the train with yeah, the... Yeah, the part where he's the holding the, yeah, the ships together is a yeah. real big callback to Spider-Man 2 where he's holding the train, trying to hold the train back. And um, also, like, uh, just the fucking, just like the regular casual scene where like him and his best friend are like tagging out that chick. And, oh, uh, and the, yeah, yeah the Zendaya is like right? Zendaya is like calling them losers and shit. Like, yeah, I mean, that's that's hilarious. Like, they just like it just it's it, 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 like it shows you that he's just a kid. Like, oh, you know what? The, I think it was really cool too is the fact that he doesn't hide his his secret. Oh, he doesn't hide the fact that he's Spider Man to one of his friends. Well, he got caught. And he got caught. Yeah, yeah got but caught, you like, know, technically he was like he could have been like oh bah, you know I don't know something yeah. you know, but so, just the fact that he's like oh what the fuck you know. And that's, that's always that's always been in the comics. Like Spider Man never technically tells anybody who he is. He just always gets caught. Like like Harry caught him. Yeah. Mary Jane catches him. And even Gwen, I think at one point in the comics, catches him. Like it's just him getting caught. Like he's just being careless. But uh, he's a kid. So. A cool part in that scene too is like the way his suit comes off. So it's like a compression suit, I guess. So like he presses the button and it decompresses, so he just slips right out of it. So I thought that was I've never seen that before. Like that's the first time in the movies that we've seen that because usually you just think. Like, they just go to the alley and they just put on this tight-ass fucking suit. Like, <laughs> you know? They gotta oil their body. Yeah. So how's he it's, gonna jump in it? So, like, he's I mean... Like, he just puts it on and then he presses the little spider emblem and it compresses against... Like, it seals around his body. So I thought that was pretty sick. Uh, he's got the web wings. I think that's the biggest fucking, like, take. Oh, yeah. That, that, was, like that was pretty that, badass. I mean, I like the web wings. Different. I'm a Spider-Man fan. Like, for all you Spider-Man fans, like, that's, that's like, classic Steve Ditko. Like, when Stan Lee first created Spider-Man... Um, he had the web wings, like the web wings, and like what it is is like when he's swinging in high altitudes, it helps him glide, glide, and, and, and sort of just control where he's falling instead of just fucking free falling and shit. You know, I thought it looked pretty. I mean, it was a, a nice addition. Yeah, it wasn't too much, and it looks like it's gonna be added. Like it's just gonna use it for tactical things. Like it's not gonna, it's not like if he's waving, you're not gonna see the fucking web wings like hanging out. You know, just flapping there just and shit. It them. looks at a certain point where he's fighting Vulture that he doesn't have that suit anymore. Yeah, so it, I don't know how how it's gonna be. Um, also, I think the the lineage too, like the timeline of this is it's it's like it's before and after Civil War, from what it looks like. Cause at, uh, at the beginning of the trailer, you can see like he still has his old costume. Yeah. Like I don't know if you guys see the teaser where Happy Hogan from the Iron Man series is like, "Where's the suitcase?" You know, like, "Where's the suitcase?" Because he Mount still Man. has on his old school suit. Yeah. So like, this might take place before Civil War, and then part of it might take place after. Not only that, I mean Tony Stark already has that black eye. Yeah. Before, so. so. Like, um, also, I mean, that's that's the one thing Tony Stark's in the movie. That's cool. I mean, as a Spider-Man fan... It looks like fan, they're going to fight together, too. Yeah, it does. I don't like it in terms of it kind of takes away from Spider-Man. Not because he's kind of stealing the spotlight, but um, in the comics, he's a poor kid, man. Like, he's fucking poor, you know? He's always been broke. Yeah. He's broke, but here it looks like Tony's giving him everything. Which kind of takes So he's just like a fucking, you know, like... Trust fund kid now. I'm like, oh come on. <laughs> but I feel like well, I mean, he he was always smart. So and that's the whole thing too. Like he's smart, and it looks like Tony's creating everything. When in the comics, Spider Man created all that shit. You know, so I kind of yeah. like it's kind of taking away from like the character development to me. Like the Spider Man should be the one inventing the web wings, and the fucking you know and the and the shooters. And well, we Spider-Man. don't know. We don't know if actually Spider Man ended up creating. I feel like it. so far we know that. Feel like that's just gonna um, take away his suit. He's gonna, he, that's why he's gonna wear his old suit. Yes. Because I feel like there's that disagreement with him and Tony. Because Tony's treating him like a kid. And I think that's whenever he takes off his suit, it's like, I don't need your shit. Yeah, maybe. I mean, we might see. And hopefully, if it's if anything, it's, it's maybe it's like Peter's making... He's getting these ideas, but he just doesn't have the resources to create it. So maybe Tony's the one that's like, okay, I can make that for you. But it, like I just feel like they need to show how smart Peter Parker is. Because he's one of the smartest characters in the freaking... Yeah, I mean, Marvel Cinematic Universe, technically, so... He needs to go into the... Yeah, uh, in terms of the villain, Vulture, from what we saw, he looks fucking sick. I think villains. he looks... I think he looks fucking yeah, sick. Yeah, he man. looks awesome. Like, Vulture, That's like, if you don't know the comics, dude, he's like some fucking wrinkly-ass old man, old man in a yeah. damn bird costume. A yeah, fucking latex costume, If too. anything <laughs> screams rapist, it's Vulture, but, uh... <laughs> he, they yeah. actually made him look like a badass, man. He looks scary, too. Yeah, like, yeah he looks badass. In the comics... Yeah, but I mean, Michael Keaton I mean, looks heard, like he's gonna kill that role, man. I heard there was two two more villains on the. Uh, as from, well, I don't know who the other one is. I mean, there's Shocker. Well, yeah, Shocker's in it. There's a little tease. Rewatch the trailer. I mean, they're 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 kind of like there's a scene where he kind of just messes with it and like Shocker, he just uses shockwaves. He's not like Electro. 
And uh, yeah, so you do see a scene where like he kind of punches like a bus, I guess. Yeah, and then and there's the, like a doctor. Or yeah, and then the other guys like they didn't really show him in the trailer, but there's Tinkerer, the guy that's making all the weapons and stuff. So he makes a uh, uh, vulture suit, and he makes Shocker's gauntlets, and that's sort of how they're linking Spider-Man to the Marvel Cinematic Universe because all that equipment is from the Avengers movie. So from those aliens, all that crash yeah. tech. Yes. So apparently that's what he's using to make all those suits. So um, that might be a problem for the movie, having that many villains, especially for the first fucking movie. And we don't know it's going to be. Yeah, and because again. I mean, it's happened to, in both Spider-Man series. Spider-Man 3, fucking three villains destroyed the movie. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man 2, there's, what, two, two, three villains? Yeah. yeah, Rhino, Green Goblin, and freaking Electro. Yeah, but Rhino didn't really come out towards the end. Even though. then, like, it was pointless to have them. So, like, I'm a little worried in terms of how like, they're going to... happen, right? Like, what the hell is, like, what, when's Shocker going to appear? Because I really want to, like, Vulture looks badass. I'd rather just focus on Vulture. So, I don't know if the Shocker's even going to have a big role. He might just be, like, someone that pops he up. He probably might be, like, a side. Yes, and if... <laughs> like, kind of like KG Beast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like, like that, an instrument. Yeah. So if anything, if they kind of work it around that way, I mean, I have faith in Marvel. The movie looks sick. It looks uh, fine. I mean, it looks badass. Uh, we, I think uh, they they did say there might be another trailer for the Super Bowl. Keep an eye out for the trailer, guys. Um, and if you haven't seen the, uh, the trailers that released, uh, what was it, last month or a couple weeks ago? For what? For, for uh, Homecoming? Oh, yeah. yeah, it was like a couple weeks ago. You should check them out. The only thing I don't like is, is it... The sequel gonna be called Homecoming too? No, 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 no. no. So, uh, that's what I heard, and I was like, bro. No, no. What they're doing is, I think, in terms of what they're doing for the Spider-Man movies, is like, they're, yeah, they're going with like, <laughs> they're going with comic book titles. So yeah, Spider-Man Homecoming or Spider-Man something else. Like they're gonna go with like a comic book title lineage. But basically, they said every movie he's gonna be moving up a year in high school. So, so the Spider-Man Homecoming is it's not gonna be Spider- right? it's not gonna be Spider-Man Homecoming too. The reason it's called Spider-Man Homecoming is because. During that movie, it's the homecoming dance and stuff like that. So, but the vulture's the in the comic book. The vulture is the 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 first villain that he gets. That's the whole thing. That's the main reason they brought uh, vulture too. He's Spider Man. Like vulture is the first villain that Spider Man fights when he first gets his powers. If they do this in the sinister, I thought it was a green goblin. The sinister seven or the sinister six. Six, Yeah, sinister six. You think they'll put Shocker in there? No, I don't know. Honestly, who knows how they're gonna do it? I know they're trying to work on Venom and stuff like that. So. Hopefully down the line, maybe in part two or part three of Spider-Man, uh, Tom Holland signed off for three movies for the Spider-Man series, but he t- signed off for a total of nine in the MCU. Yeah. So wow. three of those nine are the Spider-Man movies, and then the rest, I guess, is him popping up in Avengers or whatever. Does that count as Civil War? Uh, yeah, that counted, that counted Civil War. So he has eight more to he go. He has eight more to go, so... Uh, uh, seven, because he just made one, so... Yeah, so, um, I mean, other than that, I guess that's it for all the information that came out, guys. Uh... That's it. Yeah, that's it. Uh, keep posted. We will, you know, we're gonna have another video coming out soon. I mean, we're only gone for a couple of days, right? Uh, we're filming tell, tomorrow. Tell, <laughs> tell all your friends. It's not that we our... didn't film. It's that we didn't upload. Yeah, we just didn't upload. It was rendering this whole. Thing. Uh, I forgot to pay my internet bill, so that shit went out. So, uh, like we, you know, like we always say in the other videos, guys, is routine. Uh, just make sure to subscribe. Uh, comment, let us know what kind of stuff you guys want us to talk Share about. Share us to your friends that are interested. Yeah, it's like you guys are giving us like the silent treatment or some shit, bro. I know, I mean, right? do shit to you guys, man. I mean, it's not like we disappeared for like... I know! <laughs> <laughs> we were just here yesterday. Yeah, uh, the it was... The setup's the same. It was a test, so we're just waiting to see if you guys even noticed, like... See who are loyal. <laughs> they can't say the No fucks so given. Right. No fucks given, no. bro. <laughs> so just, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, also check out our Instagram page. We do constantly we'll upgrading. Show. Yeah, we're constantly upgrading the... Uh, upgrading, updating the, the Instagram page. Uh, it's just the What Push Show, right? Yeah, the What Push Show. Just check out the What Push Show. Um, link in the description. Yeah, link is in the description. These, and just these people don't show up, man. That's why yeah. Trump won because they didn't go show up to vote. I this is know. what happens, guys. This you is guys... what happens when y'all don't speak. It's all your fault. So just let just let us know, man. Let us know what you guys want to do. Also, hit us up on PlayStation or Xbox if y'all want to game. Get and your ass. Uh, we'll see you guys next time.